So wrapping it up, my top three uh, for 2022, you know, I picked um, first up was Resilience and the Path to Achieving the Dream. That was with Daniel Daura, who is the uh, CTO of Pebble B. Um, Pebble B creates essentially tracking devices. But I think what was really great about his story was the resilience piece, um, how he was a co-founder and co-founded this um, over the course of many years with full transparency uh, with uh, while he was working at Boeing, I believe, um, with his, his friend. And they were able to develop Pebble B. Unfortunately, his co-founder um, passed away and he shared that very heartfelt story with us and how he, you know, had to kind of there she is, Zoe again. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> Can you hear her? Camila. Camila. Uh, <laughs> Sister, <laughs> sisterhood, motherhood, working from home. Hello. Uh, but yeah, just a really true, heartfelt story of his own and the company's, you know, resilience and working through challenging times. And of course, a great device that's all about connecting people and how they really have differentiated themselves. Um, I really enjoyed that show, The Device, and how they're kind of differentiating themselves in terms of accessibility, um, the reports and the things that they're able to do on the mobile side, which I find to be really fascinating. My second pick was Open Data and the API Economy, the Future of Fintech with Rachel Carpenter. She's the CEO at Intrinio. Um, kind of aligned with you, uh, America, with Anne Hand, I found uh, Rachel's story to be an extremely inspiring one uh, in terms of her entrepreneurship and this kind of bootstrap mentality of how she was able to start Intrinio. And then just the heart behind Intrinio and, and the data that they're compiling in order to make other fintech companies be successful in what they're doing. And I think that's just a great leap forward and look forward to seeing a lot, a lot of things out there that say powered by Intrinio, right? And then of course, my final third was Wi-Fi sensing, the most ubiquitous tech you might not have heard of. And that was a Spencer made CCO of Origin Wireless. Um, what I really liked about his show was a lot of the shows that we talked about was the personal story behind it, what sort of led up to this, um, his own mother, the need to kind of take care of older people in the home. But what's really cool about their technology is that they're taking advantage of Wi-Fi devices that we already have on hand, things like our smart TVs, our tablets, that are actually able to do a lot of this sensing without actually having to, you know, implement all these strange, somewhat invasive feeling, you know, sensors and other components in our home um, in terms of security and, and other things. So I thought that was a really great, interesting piece of tech, as well as the heart behind it. So those are my top three for 2022.